The girls who snubbed us, the boys who deserted us, the strangers who ignored us, the parents who misunderstood us, the employers who rejected us, the mentors who doubted us, the bullies who beat us, the siblings who mocked us, the friends who abandoned us, the conformists who excluded us, the kisses we were denied because no one saw us. They were all too busy turning their gaze elsewhere while I was directing my gaze at you. Only at you. Because I am one of you. <laughs> Sorrow has no hierarchy. Suffering is not a sport. There is no final ranking. Tormented by acne and shyness, by stretch marks and discomfort, by boldness and insecurity, by anorexia and bulimia, by obesity and diversity, reviled for the color of our skin, our sexual orientation, our empty wallets, our physical impairments, our arguments with our elders, our inconsolable weeping, the abyss of our insignificance, the caverns of our loss, the emptiness inside us, the recurring incurable thought of ending it all, nowhere to rest, nowhere to stand, nothing to belong to, nothing, nothing, Nothing. Yes. That is how we felt. And just like you, I remember it all. But it no longer matters that the world took issue with us. For now it is us who shall take issue with the world. We will no longer tolerate being named as the problem because in point of fact, they are the problem. We are the solution. We who have been betrayed and abandoned, rejected and misunderstood, put aside and diminished. There is no place for you here. They told us with their silence. Then where is our place? We implored them with our silence. We never received that reply, but now we know, yes, we know our place. Our place is here. Our place is the church. Cardinal Biffy said it first, and in an astonishingly simple way. We are all miserable wretches whom God brought together to form a glorious church. Yes, we are all miserable wretches. Yes, we are all the same. And yes, we are the forgotten ones but no longer. From this day forth, we shall no longer be forgotten. I assure you, they will remember us because we are the church.